Have you ever pondered the origins of the Gujar nation, that resilient group of people who have carved their identities into the rugged landscapes of South Asia? Today, we delve into the annals of history to uncover their roots. The story of the Gujar nation begins in the bygone era, around the 1st century AD. Historians believe that they were once a part of the Kushan Empire, a synthesis of various tribes, cultures and ethnic groups. As the empire crumbled, the Gujar people emerged, named after the term Gurjara, meaning enemy destroyers, a testament to their strength and resilience. It is believed that the Gujars are migrated to different parts of Indian subcontinent from Gurjara kingdom. The Gujarat and Rajasthan were known as Gurjaradesa and Gurjaratra previously due to dominating Gurjar population. Gujars are linguistically and religiously diverse and have their own language which is known as Gujari. The Middle Ages saw the rise of the Gujar Pratiharas, a dynasty that ruled vast swaths of northern India. These were the golden years for the Gujar nation, with their influence spreading far and wide, their culture thriving, and their political power at its zenith. Fast forward to the British colonial era, the Gujar nation underwent a significant transformation. The British classified the Gujars as a martial race, a group of people deemed naturally warlike and aggressive. This categorization influenced the perception and societal role of the Gujar people, shaping their destiny in the years to come. The Gujar nation, a people known for their courage and resilience, played a pivotal role in the 1857 War of Independence against British rule. Their warriors, renowned for their bravery, stood tall against the oppressive forces, fighting valiantly on the front lines of the struggle for freedom. As we delve into the archives and resurrect images of Gujar warriors, scenes from the Independence War come to life, painting a vivid picture of their relentless spirit. Their significant contribution to this historic uprising is a testament to the Gujar's indomitable spirit, a chapter of their history that continues to inspire generations. Let's embark on a mesmerizing voyage into the enthralling world of genetics, fresh DNA research on the Gujar population. Population uncovers fascinating truths about their lineage. Their DNA contains a significant percentage of the R101 haplogroup, a genetic marker tied to the Indo-European language family. This implies a close genetic relationship with other tribes and nations bearing the same marker, such as the Rajputs, Jats and Pashtuns. On top of this, the Gujar DNA also shows a considerable presence of haplogroup H, typically found among the Dravidian tribes of South India. This genetic connection hints at a historical migration and intermingling of populations, painting an image of a diverse and dynamic South Asian history. Intriguingly, the Gujar DNA also bears some with the DNA of the Roma people of Europe, especially those in Eastern Europe. This correspondence suggests a historical connection potentially a migration from the Indian subcontinent to Europe, adding another intricate layer to the Gujar's complex past. Past, supplementing these genetic insights, a DNA report from a study published on the ALS Journal website gives additional validation. This report reveals that the Gujar population has a high prevalence of the J2M172 haplogroup, which is linked with the spread and herding from the Middle East. This implies that the Gujars may have been among the early pioneers of farming and animal husbandry, contributing to their resilience and adaptability. Incorporating yet another DNA report from a study retrieved from prr.hec.gov.pk unveils more about the Gujar population. This comprehensive report further confirms the genetic traits discussed earlier and provides an expanded analysis of the Gujar's genetic makeup and historical connections. This additional evidence enriches our understanding of the Gujar's rich and diverse genetic history. Gujars are characterized by having predominantly R1A1AM17Y chromosomes, the frequency of which is the highest observed among the populations of the Indus Valley. Otherwise, they are marked by 30% South Asian haplotypes and a low frequency of East Asian haplotypes. They also have a high frequency of South Asian haplogroup LM20 compared to other KPP populations, supporting their historically documented affinities with various South Asian ethnic groups, 
especially those residing in the northwestern portion of South Asia. Gujar maternal ancestry is largely congruent with their paternal genetic ancestry. Their mtDNAs are largely of Wi origin, although some derive from SA and EA81. Gujars also possess haplogroups linking them with West Asia, HV, U7W, while having relatively few East Asia mtDNAs. Based on this pattern of diversity, they show strong genetic affinities with the Yusafzais, Kashmiri, and other Pakistani populations. In conclusion, the Gujar nation, with their rich history and diverse genetic makeup, stands as a living testament to the intricate dance of history, culture, and genetics. According to a DNA report published on Nature.com, their genetic lineage is connected to various tribes and nations, creating a rich tapestry of shared heritage and collective history. This report further validates the Gujar's intricate connection to a multitude of different ethnic groups, reinforcing the age-old adage that we are all more similar than we are different. The Gujar people, in their existence, serve to remind us that beneath our individual identities lie common roots and a shared past that transcends borders and cultures. As we journey deeper into the 21st century, the Gujar nation, like all of us, continues to evolve and adapt. Their story, backed by solid DNA evidence, is a captivating chapter in the grand saga.